New at six, there could be a new overpass built over the Beltline on Perry Street. The U.S. Department of Transportation granted the city of Madison one million dollars to do a study and design the overpass reconnecting Perry Street. Now, this is part of the funding President Biden announced today. WMTV's Marcus Arsvold shares what a local business owner thinks about that project. Opening up basically another way of getting here um, would be absolutely, I mean, fantastic. Cheddar O'Brien owns an auto and marine repair shop on Perry Street. He thinks an overpass on Perry Street would be good for business. We are tucked in a pocket, so having another possible way of getting here where you don't have to go halfway across town. O'Brien says one of the biggest problems he has is customers will call him on the other side of the Beltline on Perry Street over there trying to find his business, but they can't do so. Then when he tells them that he's actually on this side of the Beltline, they'll have to take that big machinery through. I can't tell you how many times somebody has gone to that side of Perry Street called me, said they can't find the shop, and then I'm saying, oh, we're on the other side, and then they have to do a whole maze to get onto the highway just to get to this side of Perry Street. The actual construction of the overpass, um, you know, we'd have to kind of, I think, wait a bit for the outcome of this process. Ben Zellers with the City of Madison Planning Division says the project isn't a done deal yet, but $1 million from the federal government is a good sign. As far as whether or not construction is a done deal, um, and you know, it's hard, hard for me to guarantee that at this point, but this is a really solid step in um, looking at uh, making that Perry Street overpass improvement. O'Brien says if it goes through, Perry Street will need more upkeep and better parking options, but still, he thinks more traffic is a good thing. So having a quick access way, even if they weren't directly on the south side, would open up I mean, so many windows, so many doors, so that would be great. In Madison, Marcus Arsvold, WMTV 15 News.